put it right back here is okay? Yeah. All right. Feeding San Diego held a special holiday food distribution thanks to a large turkey donation from Cargill. It's so nice to have the extra help and the support for the holidays. Rebecca Brown and her family live in Tierra Santa. Times are a little tough right now, so it always helps anything we're able to get. Her husband is in the Navy and will be able to enjoy a yummy holiday meal with their four children because of this food donation. Super, super grateful. My husband's home for Christmas this year. We didn't have him last year, so we're super excited to have some a fancy meal to make. Besides a 16 to 22 pound turkey, about 500 families are getting stuffing and gravy to enjoy with it. There's a huge need right now. We're seeing like a 20% increase across all of our distributions. Allison Gladder is the marketing and communications consultant for Feeding San Diego and describes why more families need help feeding their loved ones. The moratorium gone, the gas prices going up, food prices, all of it, like we can definitely tell. And also the holidays, you know, people need to spend a little extra to try to hopefully give their kids gifts or, you know, whatever it is they need to travel. So hopefully at least this can help alleviate one worry and have food on the table. Events like this could not run without the help of volunteers. El Chera Ayad has been volunteering with Feeding San Diego for almost a year and a half. Just the connection with the people and seeing their faces, it's priceless. It's, you don't know the feeling until you actually do it, but it's, it's just heartwarming. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. If you're experiencing food insecurity or would like to donate or volunteer with Feeding San Diego, go to feedingsandiego.org. Melissa May, KPBS News.